Keep an eye on your bank account. That's the message from police tonight. People who shop at Big Y card skimming devices were found on registers in Naugatuck in, and Plainville at the stores there. News 8's Tim Harpin shows you what to be on the lookout for. Big Y customers are cautious after the grocery store chain announced they found card skimmers at two Connecticut stores. It's terrible. You know, I hope it, nobody had problems with it. Just getting the insight on that uh, would definitely make me be more cautious in everywhere I go, really. Big Y spokesperson Jade Rivera McFarland says the company discovered one skimmer at each of its Plainville and Naugatuck locations. At this time, we don't have any reports of anybody having any of their information compromised, but we want people to be alert. She says the skimmers were discovered June 29th and were not inside those stores longer than eight hours. We checked our cameras, noticed the time period and then we're able to give all that information to law enforcement. So they really weren't there for that long where they were getting a bunch of people's information. Fred Scholes, a cybersecurity expert at Quinnipiac University. He says criminals are using skimmers to steal your personal data at places including retail stores, gas stations, and ATMs. People making the skimming hardware have made it much smaller, less obtrusive, much easier to put into, let's say, a card slot. Scholl says skimmers are becoming more common nowadays, but there are steps you can take to protect yourself. One tip, check your bank and credit card statements on a regular basis. Somebody may steal uh, your credit card number and maybe a month later somebody else will use that for a you know a purchase using your accounts. He also says you should look out for broken hardware and that your card doesn't jam. Also use contactless payment whenever possible. That is way more secure than just using plastic credit cards. Big Y says anyone who had their information compromised should contact the company's customer service line. We're even more so vigilant now because of this. So no, we are not aware of any any more anywhere else and we're constantly checking just to be safe. In Plainville, Tim Harfman, News 8.